guys! So today I did another heatless hair tutorial and this is my Taylor Swift inspired hair. Taylor Swift, as you guys know, sports her really tight curls all the time and I thought with summer here it would be a great opportunity for me to do another heatless hair tutorial and I know you guys have requested a lot since I posted my last one, which I will link down below in the bottom bar. So if you haven't seen my first hair tutorial, then definitely go check that out. So without further ado, I guess we'll just get into the video. And if you guys want to see how to create these tight Taylor Swift heatless inspired curls, then just keep watching. So I usually do this hairstyle right when I get out of the shower and when my hair is damp. Next, I'm just taking my suave detangling spray and spraying this liberally throughout my hair. So taking a wide tooth comb, I'm brushing my hair starting at the ends and then working my way up. This way is the least damaging way to brush your hair while it's wet. Next I'm taking my Moroccan Argan Oil by Organics and I'm just applying about a dime size amount and applying this mainly to the ends of my hair. Then I run my fingers through my hair to evenly distribute the oil. So for this hairstyle, I'm taking these flexible rollers by Hot Tools. They're also known as flexi rods and I got mine at Ulta for around $8. So the technique that I use for this hairstyle is that I pretend the flexi rod is actually a clipless curling iron and I'm just wrapping my hair around the flexi rod away from my face. So after I fold in the ends, I like to squeeze the entire rod just to make sure that the curls stay in while I'm sleeping. So I'm moving on to the next side and I'm just going to be using the same technique, wrapping my hair away from my face around the curling rod. So I'm going to be finishing up these last sections of hair and then this is what your hair should look like when you're done. So it is the morning now and as you guys can tell I just got dressed, put my makeup on, but I left the curlers in and most of them stayed in pretty well. There's a couple at the bottom but that always kind of fall out and unravel but that is okay we're just going to work with it. So I'm just going to go ahead and take the curlers out and then you guys can see sort of the final product. And as you can tell, you get this really tight curl. So I'm just gonna go ahead and take the rest out. Lost in time somehow. Watch the so there's no real technique on how I take the rollers out. I basically just go section by section and take them out of my hair. So you can be more careful than I am when unraveling the curls if you want your hair to be more uniformed. So I'm going to continue taking out the curlers until they're all gone. And that's pretty much it for the look. Okay, so as you guys can see, I get these really tight curls and they will definitely fall out throughout the day. I like them when they fall out better than right now because they're obviously a little too tight for me but they're definitely Taylor Swift inspired because she has the really signature tight curls but I'm just gonna go ahead and add a little bit of my Moroccan argan oil. This is from Organic so it's just a drugstore brand. I'm just gonna add a little size of this and kind of work it just into the ends because when my hair falls out it'll give it just a more kind of relaxed, shiny feel to it. So I just like to put this only on my ends because it can have the appearance of looking greasy if you um, apply it at your roots. Okay, so that is pretty much the finished hair look, but I will be back in a few hours to show you guys how the hair looks when it kind of falls and relaxes a little bit. So I will see you guys in a sec. So it's a few hours later and I just wanted to show you guys sort of the final, final product on the hair, as you can tell, the curls are still pretty tight. 
um, but they are a little less uniformed and just a little more relaxed, which I do like that look a lot. Of course, if you guys like the tighter curl look, like the really Taylor Swift tight curls, then of course you could spray a bunch of hairspray in your hair, and I'm sure they'll probably stay a little bit better, but I do like when they kind of relax a little bit. So that is pretty much it. I hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know down below if you want to see more heatless hair tutorials and I can definitely come up with a few more for you guys. So I will see you guys very soon in my next video. Bye!